YouTube uh, live stream. Here, the Williams Grove, not the Williams Grove, but the World of Outlaws game. Um, we're gonna be hitting our live chat real quick before we hop in. Um, we're gonna be hitting our live chat real quick before we hop in. All right. <clears throat> All right. Cool. All right. We're good. Kind of lobbies we got. What kind of lobbies we got? What kind of lobbies we got? Come on, give me some good ones. Sis. What is that? Is that street stock? I think that is a street stock race. Um. We'll, we'll do this one. We'll do this one. I think this is a street stock. Street stock, yep. Yep, street stock. 16 laps. I'm not waiting for that. Let's try to hop in something right away. There we go. Alright. Alright, my coffee is being made, so we'll get some coffee when we're done. Oh, we'll look. <laughs> God damn. Uh, in our <laughs> I'm not going to start complaining right away, but we I think we all know how I feel about this uh, track. <clears throat> uh, so how you guys doing? How you guys doing? This game's been out for about a week now, going on a week. Uh, two days from now, going on a week. Uh, very, very busy week. Very, very busy week, especially for me in streaming the content. Uh, but it's also been very, very busy, uh, for this game. At least online traffic has been very, very busy. I'm glad to see everyone's on the game. Everyone's enjoying the game. Um, the only thing that I, I, I'd really say to watch out for when you do buy the game is you need to look out for the lobbies you join. Hey, I'm here, but I'm at church, so I won't be able to watch you till later, okay? Sounds good, Chase. Have a good one at church. Uh, but the only thing I would say watch out for online is uh, the lobbies you join. Uh, there are some lobbies that just do not care for the life of them to drive clean. Uh, those are the lobbies that will kill every Thanks, ounce of fun man. you'll have in this game. Uh, those are the type of lobbies that ruin games. Uh, so you need to look out for who you join and who you race against because you don't want to. You you don't want this experience to be ruined for you uh, by the actions of others. Uh, this game is very very good, very very thought out, very 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 well thought out. They took their time on this game, and to see people trying to ruin it by, you know, just driving right into people in the first turn of any race uh, disappoints me greatly. Uh, but, yeah, that's the, that's the, that's, that's the only caveat to this game. You need to look out, you need to look out for who you race with and who you join, uh, or else you're going to get, you're, you're going to get either destroyed or you're going to lose interest in this game fast. Because there are dirty racers in this game, along with any other racing game there is on the market. Um, but, you know, I, I've been fortunate enough to join lobbies where everyone's clean, and I've had some great freaking races. Uh, so, that, of course, helps. Um, it doesn't help when someone refuses to get on the gas in the start of the race. Uh, but, yeah. Don't understand the point of that. The Maverick 90. Oh, uh, the green flag's out. Does that mean, uh, slow down? <laughs> Alright, first race of the day. Feeling a little rusty. Oh god, that's not what I want to do. That bottom burn is a bitch.
Again, I hit that berm and fucking sent me up the track. <clears throat> uh, yeah, that wasn't too good of a race. I, I, I'll be the first to admit that. Uh, the start was awful. I don't know what that guy was thinking. Um, just refused to get on the gas. Uh, but whatever. Um, yeah, it was a good race. I'm not too uh, familiar with Salt Sawtooth Mountain, but I'll take a third place finish. Uh, NW... R. I don't know if I got into him or not. It certainly looked like he was getting into me. I passed him clean. I know that. Um, but yeah, it's whatever. Uh, by the way, this whole narrative that anything goes on the last lap needs to be fucking. <laughs> if if that's your mindset, it's like if you're running second and it's the last lap and you're like, you know what, anything goes on the last lap. I'm just gonna dump the guy in first. Uh, you're a piece of fucking shit. That's not how racing goes. That's not how racing works. There's nobody on any fucking, uh, any fucking racing circuit uh, that will dump somebody on the last lap just to win, okay? Nobody in any racing circuit is under the impression that anything goes on the last lap, alright? Because in real life racing, if you were to dump somebody in the last lap to win, you're either gonna get beat the fuck up in the pits or you're gonna kill somebody. It, it's as simple as that. And, and uh, for people to treat this game differently... Uh, this shows you the mindset some people have. <clears throat> very, very weak-minded people. He had a seven. A seven. Holy fuck. Guy was rolling. Guy was fucking rolling. Now why are we? Now why are we paused? Now I I I'm the host now, so I can unpause it. What the fuck? Come on, guys! It's a little too early in my live stream to be fucking it all up. Come on! Don't piss Strip Zero off already. Don't do it. It's goddamn terrible. Oh my god, dude. This fucking blows dick. I join a lobby, I get third place, and then they all want to leave. Up, oh, Drip Zero's in the lobby. We're not gonna win next race. Might as well fucking find a new one. They are fucking lord. There's something about my name, guys. There's something about Drip Zero. When you see Drip Zero in your lobby, it sometimes tempts people to want to leave and go find a new one. I'll take it as a compliment. But, dear lord, man. Dear freaking lord. I'm not that scary. I'm not that big and bad. Don't be afraid of Drip Zero. I think after this race, I'm gonna go get my coffee. America's home of racing. Is that really Charlotte? America's home of racing? I don't think so. Good fucking move by that guy. God damn. Got a little too low. Set truck got me loose. Dude, what are you doing? Loosen your car up, man. That won't happen. If you're good. If you loosen your car up, it allow it allows you on the on the back stretch to get up to the wall without slamming into it. But when you're tight and you want to move up towards the wall in the back stretch, you're gonna fucking do a nose dive, a not nose plant right into the wall. You gotta loosen your cars up, guys. You gotta loosen them up. Especially on tracks like fucking Charlotte and you're racing a 410. Loosen those bitches up. Especially if you're racing on sliders. If you're racing on expert slider, dude, loosen your fucking car up. Uh, I, I only play expert. The assist lobbies are, uh, you know, it is what it is. There's still people that want to use assists, but uh, they're ruining the game. 
they're never going to have the full experience of the game if they're racing assists on. So, uh, too bad for them. Uh, but yeah, we are all experts, so we're getting the full experience of the game right now. All right, let's try to move up the track. Oh, fuck, it's the end of the race. Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not sure what that guy was, what that guy was doing. He needs to loosen his car up. That's for sure. Uh, he spiked that wall. Spiked it. All right. You know what? I'm I'm kind of. I love the 410 sprint cars in this game. Do not get me fucking wrong. I love the 410 sprints. I love them. In real life, I, I I'm a I'm a 410 sprint car racing collector. I have a whole bunch of memorabilia from sprint car racing over the years ha hung up in my room i'm a major 410 sprint car fan i'm a major dirt racing fan but in this game specifically i feel like my strong suit is the late models I, I really do i feel like i'm better at the late models than i am at the 410s but when you look at the fast times and you look at the leaderboards i'm always on the 410 leaderboards i'm never never on the fucking late model leaderboards because there's this the player pool for the late models is just so much bigger. Um, I got another trophy. That's cool. Um, I'll 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 probably race this one. La ah, fuck, Circle Lake. Let's change the track at least. Let's do Cedar Lake. Alright guys, we're gonna run Cedar Lake, then we're probably gonna hop into a late model lobby. Then I'm gonna go grab my cup of coffee, and we're gonna enjoy our more nan. But yeah. Yeah, I, I would say the the player pool for the late models is way bigger than the player pool for the 410s. And, uh, you know, it is what it is at the end of the day. It's just people who, you know, don't know how to fucking drive a 410 on expert who just give up on it very easily. But, uh, you know, it's just what it is. It is what it is. The 410s are very difficult to drive. I did that to him. Oh my god. Come on, Drip. Dude, we might have to redo this. Uh, no, I'm. I, yeah, we're redoing this track. No fucking way, this guy just beat me. This guy. Oh my god. Dude, honestly, dude, I'm so fucking sick and goddamn tired to losing to people who somehow fucking find a way to take up the whole track. You don't want to keep. You don't want to be behind anybody in this game. No wonder fucking people wreck each other, because everyone takes up the whole fucking track. God, dude, we're redoing this fucking track, and I'm gonna put this guy a fucking lap down. Tempt. 
You can tempt yourself right off a fucking ledge. And how about that? I need my fucking coffee. This piece of fucking shit. He's not a piece of shit. He didn't wreck me or anything. But god damn it. No fucking wonder people want to wreck. You can't fucking save... You can't hold a line to save your fucking life. One lap, you're up top. Next lap, you're in the bottom. One turn, you're up top. Fucking next turn, you're in the fucking fence. Hold a line. Alrighty, ladies and gents, sorry about the break. Sorry about the little bit of a fucking angry let out there. But, uh, you know, it, it's, it is no wonder. I mean, no, no disrespect to Temp. He did everything he could that race. He won fair and square. He didn't wreck me or anything. Uh, but at the same time, I just wish people didn't take up the whole track doing it. You know, I mean, you can race me clean all you want. But if you're going to steal all the lines I'm taking and, you know, be all over the track, there's no chance of me even trying to pass you. I'm just going to wreck you. And if this is a clean lobby, and I'm streaming a live stream, I'm going to get criticized for it if I wreck you. I hope everyone watching and everyone in this lobby understands that. Uh, but they probably don't. So, let's just move on. How you guys doing? How you guys doing? Chase, I understand you're at uh, church. Respect that. Can't wait to get you back in here when you're done with uh, your church meeting. Uh, Sunday church, right? Alright, I should probably be at church myself after that little let out. I <laughs> but uh, it is what it is. It is what it is, guys. Uh, we got a little bit of a uh, fuller lobby now. Uh, don't know if there's anything like Tempt is, but, uh, you know, we'll see. Uh, we like we like clean racers here. We, we encourage clean driving, clean racing. I encourage it. Um, guys, every time I was dirty in a race, I uploaded it on YouTube and explained why, and it's only been one time. I uploaded it in a short. Some guy made room in the bottom when there was no room. He sent me up into the wall, and I, I made a video pretty much telling you, like, hey, if you drive like this, this is what you can expect. Uh, and, uh, you know, I, I think that's what people really need to see, is, like, if you come in the lobby expecting to wreck somebody and win, uh, you're going to be sadly mistaken. Um, but, yeah, let's see what we got here. this guy doing okay I'll give you the bottom not again not again almost hit that bottom tire there I don't think I got into Tempt, I think I just threw a slide job in his front end to hit my back end. Okay, so I got like maybe 5 to 2 zero in to watch our round. Sounds good, Chase. How you doing, man? How you doing? Whoa! Whoa, dude! Is it the other guy bumping him into me or something?
pretty good. I went to see one. Dude, are you freaking kidding me, dude? Last night. Whatever, man. These guys need to learn how to drive clean. All right. <clears throat> Back to late models, man. Back to late models. Dear freaking lord. Dear freaking lord. I, I gotta say this. I, I gotta say this. Like I said, I love the fucking 410 sprints, but god damn it, nobody knows how to fucking drive them. Nobody. Very disappointing. Very disappointing since this is the World of Outlaw sprint car game, or pretty much a sprint car game. It was fucking promoted off the backs of the World of Outlaw sprint cars. Uh, but, you know, whatever. Um. Broken wheel. We'll join his lobby. Uh, I am sipping some coffee right now, so we're we're gonna slowly wake up from this fog we're in. Um, guys, I'm not a sore loser. I I promise you that. I promise you, I'm not a sore loser. <clears throat> okay, maybe I am right away in the morning. Maybe I am right away in the morning. But hey, guess what? I take losses seriously. And uh, that's how I grow from them. That's how I become better at these games. I have seven online leaderboards across seven different racing games in the market, uh, including GTA 5. Uh, if you guys know, uh, GTA 5 had those cunning stunt series races uh, where it's like the supercars racing. I've had plenty of world records on GTA 5, and we all know GTA 5 is played by billions of Pretty people. Pretty good. I went to see Ra in 305 winged sprint cars last night. Pretty good. I went to see... MW oh wow 305 sprint cars where what track were they at what track were they at chase I saw uh, I saw a race at uh, I-55 or I-30 I forget what it was it was for the uh, American sprint car series uh, I think it was man I don't even remember but Aaron Reitzel was there Justin Sanders was there running the uh, Swindell Speed Lab 39. Um, they're 410 sprints, not 305s. Uh, but I... US 36 in Osborne, Missouri. Oh, 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 okay. Okay. Is that like your local track or something, Chase? Or is that just track you felt like going to yesterday? Um, but yeah, I, I've heard of that track. I, I, I like watching some races from there. Here and there. Um... They're still racing? Dear lord. But yeah. Still good. Still doing pretty good. It's a 3 8 mile high bank dirt oval. Limeland is my local track and it just so happens to be in the game. MOG smiling face with sunglasses. Yes, Bag Limeland is in the game. It is available for anyone who ordered Gold Edition. If you did order Gold Edition, you will have uh, more DLCs coming your way. Mid-October, late December, DLC City. Oh, and at I-30 is asks they are 360 winged sprint cars. Um... Man, every time you spell that A-S-C-S, -S, I think of the All-Star Circuit of Champions for some reason. I know it's the American Sprint Car Series, but every time I see that A, I go for All-Star. <laughs> are there any setups for this game yet? A uh, bag. Yes, there are setups for this game yet. People do have custom setups, but if you go, bag, if you go onto the worldofoutlawgame.com, you will find tips and tricks of what to set up your car for. It'll tell you stars. exactly what the setups do. Um, it'll tell you exactly what you need to turn your car to to get it uh, more loose coming off turns or more tight coming into turns. Um, if, just check out worldofoutlaws.com uh, slash car manuals uh, and it will show you everything you need to do for setup wise. But if you don't want to do that and you just want to get, uh, get a set off of a friend, just start asking around, man. But right now, I'm enjoying slider bars. I'm not really focused on too much on uh, custom setups. ILL just wait for someone to release a good one publicly. I am not smart enough for that. Yeah, uh, I don't feel like I am either, Bag. But you got to look out for who you get it from. Uh, any any kind of setups you get from online, like YouTubers, they're going to be trash. They're, they're going to be god-awful trash. 
because these YouTubers are just throwing setups together just to make a YouTube video. You know what I mean? They're not they're never they're not racing to be fast. They're just making setups to make a YouTube video. You know what I mean? They're making setups. Ice kick is all stars. Yes, I yes I know. But every, I'm just saying every time I see you spell A S C S, I think of the All Stars. Um, but you get you seriously if you if you're gonna take a setup off a YouTuber, you need to look out for that. They're not making setups to be fast. They're making setups to make a YouTube video. There's a difference. You make a setup to be fast. You make a setup to make a YouTube video. You know what I mean? You gotta look out for some of these YouTubers who really don't race online. They're just making shit to make a YouTube video. Um, but right now, I don't have a setup. I'm just racing custom sliders, and so is a lot of people. So <clears throat> This coffee's good. Not Starbucks, because I refuse to pay $11 for a small cup of coffee. I tried making my own setup at Eldor and I just asked myself how someone got a 139. I love messing around with the setups. Helps you understand it better for real life applications. What the hell, man? I didn't try wrecking him, but he just refused to let off the gas. He ran into my back end and hit the wall. It's called a slide job, ladies and gentlemen. You gotta let off the gas for this. And then he's gonna fucking wreck me. Dude, are you freaking kidding me? I threw a slide job on you. It was clean. It's not my fault you refused to let off the gas. Ugh. Dude, what is this guy fucking doing? Fuck that, dude. Are you fucking kidding me? Dude, seriously, learn how to fucking drive. On fucking real, I'm trying to stream here. I'm trying to fucking stream. You know what? Fuck this, man. Fuck Do this. sprint cars. I already did sprint cars. Uh, they're, all they're doing is wrecking, too. Dude, I don't understand this game. This game is really not that fucking difficult. It is really not that fucking difficult. I am racing on expert difficulty on a controller. Do you see me wrecking into everybody that every lap? It is not that PS5 fucking difficult. PS5 is better. PS5 is better. If PS5 is better, then explain to me why nobody has them. No wreckers, lol. Nobody has a PS5. There's only 13 people on PS5 lobbies on this game. Explain to me how they're better if they're not even capable of being released great. to everybody the that ordered them. online aren't good. How was PS5 better when I've been waiting for a PS5 that I ordered a year and a half ago? How is PS5? Please explain to me how I can wait for something I bought a year and a half ago. And explain to me how it's better. Explain to me how it's better. You and the 13 other people that still have PS5. Actually, there is a 100 people. Actually, 100 people have, have, uh, actually 100 people have, have PS5s. Okay, cool. Cool, that's good. That's a, that's a good one. Alright. Um. Yeah, not joining that lobby. That lobby sucks. That guy doesn't even know how to fucking drive. It's called a slide job. Couldn't take it. I'm making my own lobby. Well, I've right, got to go see you later today. Sounds good, Chase. You have a good one, man. Thank you so much for stopping by. Sorry, I'm a little agitated today. Just looking for good racing, man. Just looking for good racing. I just want some good racing. Damage on, custom setups, no. Allow driving aids, no. Flags, enabled. I'm gonna allow flags. Enabled. Thirty, thirty percent. All tracks hosted, late models, regular. All right, all right, we got a lobby set up. 
So if there's any PS4, let me know. Um, there is Slay Riz with the PS5. I just want to let you know. I know this isn't cross-gen play right now. But trust me, bud, here in the next update, it will be cross-gen. And I will see you in one of my lobbies. I'm sure it w I sure I will. And I'll show you how much better the PS4 is than the PS5 when I put a half a lap on you. I'm just that saying, is man. the same way people race on NASCAR Heat 5 Dirt Lobbies too. Yes, dude. I'm Yes, I love that comment. I love that comment. I've played plenty of NASCAR Heat 5. Dude, you, can, you couldn't play NASCAR Heat 5 online without a steering wheel setup. If you didn't have a steering wheel set up, you were you were getting bitched at online. I I remember I bought I bought NASCAR Heat 5. I started playing it on my controller, and all I got bitched I got bitched at. Oh, you can't hold a line. You can't hold a line. And they, people kick me out of lobbies. So I buy a fucking wheel and set up, and, and I'm fine all of a sudden. NASCAR Heat 5 is a fucking joke, dude. It's always been a fucking joke, and this game is slowly becoming a joke too, with the amount of fucking shitty racers there are online. No offense, but seriously. But, like, I, I put a slide job on the guy. It's not my fault the guy didn't let off the gas and he ran right in the back of my car. I put a slide job on him. I had, uh, like, two car lengths in front of him. It's not my fault. He was on the top. I was on the bottom. I put a slide job on him. And by the time my fucking rear end was across his nose, I had two car lengths on him. And he just ran right in the back of me and sent himself in the wall. I wasn't the dirty one. I, I pulled a clean side job. I could have pulled it at the fucking first lap like everyone else does in this game, but I didn't. I waited for it. I set him up for it. Like you're supposed to do, but it's not, It's never good enough. It's never fucking good enough. And then, I don't know if any of you watched yesterday's fucking live stream, but I got kicked out of a lobby because I said the track they were racing on is not meant for late models. They took us. They took the whole lobby. We had a lobby of eight people. The host thought it was a good idea. Alright, since we're all racing super late models, why don't we just go to a go-kart track? I'm sorry. But if you're if you're driving a if you're driving a super late model, alright, the last place you want to be is either Willow Creek or Roper Mountain. Because those are fucking terrible tracks. And you will not have a good time racing at them. I got kicked out. Of, yeah, I legitimately got kicked out of the lobby yesterday because I because I disagreed at the track the host took us to. Roper Mountain is a go kart track. I don't care what anyone says. I can get the four tens around them pretty good because they have a fucking giant wing on top of them. All right, but when you're when when you think when you think a super late model is gonna run at fucking Roper Mountain, really, you really think so? Especially in a full lobby. A Kiwi is online. Alright, we're getting a good, a little good line here going in the bottom. That turn was good. Can anyone 
Did I really hit a fucking infield tire? I don't think I did. Okay, cool. Maybe I hit the invisible wall. Dude, this is a little frustrating. I'm not gonna freaking lie. It's a little bit ridiculous, too. Little bit ridiculous, guys. Not gonna lie. Little bit ridiculous. I think Cedar Lake should work on those tires. They shouldn't do that to your car. Ugh. I can tell looking on a live stream. No, it wasn't. No, it wasn't. It wasn't a GG. I should be winning these races. Hands the fuck down. I'm just not. It wasn't I a good game. I also hit the tire. What, is this you, Bag? Is this you? Because it wasn't a good race. I'll tell you that much right now. I mean, if 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 you yeah. won, if, it, if yeah, you won, it was a good race on your part. But not on my end. Not on my end. Not on my end at all. I don't even think I hit that fucking tire, dude. I really don't. Um. And honestly, those tires are so far down in the fucking ground. Why are they fucking sending cars up into the fucking fence? They're fucking rubber tires. Come on, guy. Come on now. Come on. Where's the physics at? Where's the physics? Any time where I don't get wrecked in online is a good race laughing. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Very true. See, I want to know why people don't join lobbies anymore. I mean, you know, I, I see so many people have full fucking lobbies, but every time I make a lo I make a lobby, nobody wants to join. I don't I don't get it. It's strip zero five. I, I I guess that's the that's the only reason. I I don't know. I guarantee if I made you the host Kiwi, people would want to fucking play a view. But since strip zero's name's on the fucking host tab, God, let's not join that. Getting a little frustrating. Getting a little frustrating. Not gonna lie.
I didn't feel too bad there. I didn't feel too bad. Just, uh, I think I ranked 50 there. I don't even remember playing with my slider. Uh, but yeah, that was a definitely, definitely a good race. I tried a few different things. There's a few things you can do up front if you're in the pool. There's a few things you can do uh, when you got someone like Kiwi chasing you down that will uh, that will back him up a little bit uh, but without being dirty. Like, I, I, I let him get under me for a little bit. I knew I had the momentum on the top side. I knew I was going to get right back around him and get back to the bottom the next turn. But I, I, I let, him in, let him down on the inside that one turn. And it kind of threw him off a little bit. And uh, that's how... I got done. Dirt Track Jesus wants to play with me. Alright. <clears throat> um, Kiwi, if you can hear me, I will be right back. If not, I'll be joining someone else's lobby, and you can join. I just want to see what this guy is running, if he has a bigger lobby. Okay. Where the hell is this guy? This is it. Oh. <sighs> What the fuck? Where's this dude's lobby? I got people joining. Alright, Kiwi, I'm coming back. Not exactly sure why fucking... I got invited to something. Hi man, I'm back. What's going on, Jeff? How you doing, man? Log back to the live stream. <clears throat> Welcome back to the live stream. We're sipping on some coffee, playing some racing games. Is that a new track? Uh, no, it's Limeland. It was a part of the game when it was released when you bought the Gold Edition. Hmm, okay. Little Rage. He's a non-driving fuck. Oh yeah, I'm gonna try to wreck him. There you go. There's your receipt, bud. There you go. Don't fucking try to wreck Kiwi or me, bitch. There you go, bitch boy. How do you like that fuck crossover? You're not getting past me. Are you fucking kidding me? Are you high? Are you high? Are you fucking high? You must be high. You must be fucking high. You're getting booted out of lobby, I can tell you that. Kiwi's gonna boot your ass. Oh, now you wanna race me clean. You fuck got it, huh? You're a fucking idiot. This guy's a fucking idiot if he thinks that's gonna work. Oh, there you go. There you go. Show your nature, dude. Show your nature, little rage. Yep, it's okay, Kiwi. You can put him in the wall. He doesn't care. Kiwi, that's the wrong fucking guy. Oh, that wasn't even you, Kiwi. Alright, so we have two of them just, that just want to wreck. So we gotta kick everyone that joined the lobby, pretty much. Because they suck at driving. I'm gonna catch up to this guy real quick. Teach him a lesson. Oh, yeah. 
Oh, yeah. He's so fast, guys. That's why I fucking caught up to him so fuck quick. He is so fast. No wonder he has to wreck people. He fucking sucks, dude. Let off the gas. Maybe he won't send you up the track. All right, you ready, little Rage? This is gonna make you famous. I just made you famous, bitch. Get him. Get him, Kiwi. Get him. Dude, are you fucking kidding me? Boot everybody. Boot them all, Kiwi. Boot them all. Dude, on fucking real. These guys fucking suck, man. On fucking believable. Dude, literally, I just want to fucking... Dude, if these guys were in front of me right now, I'd beat them to a fucking pulp. I'd literally beat them to a fucking pulp. How am I a bitch? How am I a fucking bitch? You come into my fucking lobby and start wrecking people? And why, why is that? Why did I do that? Because he came in our lobby and wrecked the first two people. You're a fucking idiot, dude. This guy's a fucking idiot. I watched you hit him seven yeah, times. These people are so dumb. Yeah, I know these people are so fucking dumb. Before you kick him, I got something else to say to him. Hey, dipshit. Hey, dipshit. I have a live stream going right now. If you like to fucking watch, you can watch it, dipshit. Keep him in the lobby, Kiwi. Keep him in the lobby. Keep him in the lobby. I'm going to race this fucker clean and fucking put him a half a lap down. And let's see how fucking fast that lap is then. Keep him in the lobby. He's so fucking fast, right? Let's see how fast he is in that fucking clean ass lobby. Oh, he left. He left. What happened? What the fuck happened? Fucking idiot, dude. He's a fucking ignorant fuck, dude. Ignorant fucking people. I watched you wreck him seven times. After he got fucking... Oh my god, dude. These people are so fucking dumb. It's so fucking irritating. I hope this guy motherfucking shows up to my house, man. I hope he fucking shows up to my house. God damn it, dude. This is not the fucking day. This is not the fucking day to be joining my lobby and fucking wrecking me, dude. Not the fucking day. I will fucking tie this guy in a fucking knot and make him scream for his fucking dead grandmother. This guy has no fucking idea how to fucking race. This guy has no idea how to fucking talk. I wish people on online had a brain. Oh, he has a brain. It's just, it's, it's not, it's not, it's not our fault that it's corrupted with fucking methamphetamine and fucking cocaine. Fucking idiots. You really think I'm gonna intentionally drive dirty on a fucking live stream? Are you fucking kidding me? I'll certainly give someone their receipt if they want to wreck me. These fucking people fucking cannot think past their fucking noses, dude. I swear to fucking God. When you have more fucking pubic hair on your fucking chest and you do brain cells, there's something fucking wrong. I love the clean racers, man. I love them. It makes me appreciate them even more. Ah, I'm sorry, guys. I'm getting fired up. I'm getting fired up. I am. I hate being accused of driving dirty, especially when other people fucking start it. Hate that shit. Don't ever accuse me of driving dirty. When all, when the, my entire time playing this game has been fucking recorded and is on my fucking YouTube channel. I, like I said earlier in the stream, every time I've been dirty, I've made a fucking YouTube video about it. Explain to you why I put this guy in the wall. And it's always been in retaliation. Always. I never, not once, ever in this game joined the lobby with the sole intention of wrecking somebody. Not one time. I join lobbies with the sole intention of winning, or at least having a good race doing it. Fucking idiots, man. You wanna pay $53 for a video game just to hop on and wreck everybody online? You're a fucking loser, man. You're a fucking loser who doesn't deserve employment, who doesn't deserve income. You're a fucking loser, dude.
Your, your only source of enjoyment is ruining other people's enjoyment. That is a sad life, dude. That's a fucking sad fucking life. The only source of enjoyment you can find in your fucking sad, pathetic, meth, and meth fucking infested life is going ahead and ruining other people's fun. You're a fucking sad excuse for a human being, and pretty soon you're gonna be fucking dead and off this earth. Thank God. One of these days, man, one of these days, these fucking asshats are gonna come across the wrong fucking guy that can come across, that can find their fucking address, man. It is 2022, and you're gonna hop online and be a dipshit? Dude, you're gonna fucking find yourself hurt, man. There are so many fucking people online nowadays that fucking can do crazy shit, and you're gonna fucking stumble across the wrong person one day, and they're gonna fuck your shit up. Fucking unbelievable. I'm done. I'm I'm done. I'm done. We're gonna move on from it. Good race, Kiwi. Sorry if this Eric guy, Eric Sunny guy, raced you dirty. It kind of looked like you was, but. Oh, sorry. I had to go off. Had to go off, guys. Make sure you leave a like and subscribe for me going off. I know that guy that you were arguing wish from Tony Stewart Games. Tony Stewart Games. Oh. Yeah, well, I play Tony Stewart games too, and I don't have a superiority complex like that guy does. I saw you wreck him seven times! What the fuck were you watching the first seven laps then? What the fuck were you watching at the beginning of the race? You watched me wreck him? What the fuck? What, what the fuck were you watching before that? Fucking idiots, dude. I swear to fucking God. Oh. I watched you wreck him seven times, man. I watched you wreck him seven times. There's barely even seven fucking laps in those races, dude. I watched you wreck him seven times. I watched you wreck him seven times. Okay, what the fuck are you watching before that? Williams Grove, please. Do Williams Grove. I haven't, I haven't ran much Williams Grove on those late models. Dude, Kiwi. I'm so glad you're in this fucking lobby, man. You make me feel so much fucking better. At least I you're- I am not good at this track, just letting you know. Nah, it's okay. I, I don't have much experience on it as well. I'm, 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 I'm thankful you're in this lobby, Kiwi. Because now, at least, I don't fucking feel crazy. We had two dipshits come in, wreck us both, and then pretend like we were the ones doing the wrecking. When we started in front of them, we started in first and second, they started in third and fourth, and on the first turn, they put us both in the fucking wall. And then they want to act like we were the ones being dirty? We were in front of you. The only way we can race you dirty when we're in front of you is just straight up brake checking you off the start, which we didn't. Fucking people, man. I swear, man. People. Especially Dirt Track fans. Man, Dirt Track fans, man. They, they, they just can't think past their fucking noses, man. And I'm a Dirt Track fan myself, but majority of these guys are fucking idiots. Every racing fan's a pretty much a fucking idiot, honestly. Oh yeah, this is difficult. Sorry, Kiwi. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Let you back in front of me.
make sure you guys like subscribe it really mean a lot we're having a difficult time at Williamsburg with the super late models Hey, uh, Kiwi, if you can hear me, let off before you hit the turn. Let off, like, right at the first, right at the first light pull going into the turn. Let off the gas completely. Don't hit the brakes, just let off and coast into the turn. Just coast into the turn. Off the gas. Just let off before you hit the turn and then coast into the turn. Then, when you're just about ready to hit the exit of the turn, get right back on the gas. There you go, you're getting a little better, I can see you behind me. But make sure you go low, don't don't go to the high side. The high side will only benef benefit you in the 410s, Williams Grove. You want to go low in a late mile. Especially at WG. And of course, I can't even perfect my own lessons. There we go. It's alright, Kiwi, I heard that practice but yeah you gotta let off you gotta let off before you even hit the turn at Williams Grove and just let it coast into the turn that track is rough to run yeah yeah it is especially on the super late models I don't think I've ever ran Williams Grove on a super late model before I think that was my first time honestly but uh what the what the it's the same thing with the sprint cars you gotta let off before the turn and kind of coast into the turn but on the sprint car, you want to be in the high side of Williams Grove. But in a super late model, it seemed like it handled a little bit better on the inside. None of the setups the game gives you is good. None of the setups the game gives you is good. Um, I don't, I don't think that's necessarily true. Um, I think it takes practice to perfect. Um, it's, we're on slider bars. They're good. They're really good. It's just some tracks that they, you won't feel a difference to. You, it's just, just, there's some tracks where the, the, the the driving style is a lot different from the others. You know, and this is one of them where you have to let off, you know. People think racing games are all about speed. It's not all about speed. You can beat a fast car and track, but if you're not pulling consistent lap times, you're not going anywhere. Consistency beats speed every day. I'm sorry, but you can have the most money, you can have the best car, you can have the best motor, but if you're pulling a 17 second lap time this lap and then a 20, se 20 second lap time the next lap, the guy who's pulling 17 second lap times every lap is going to straight up drive by you like you're a fucking fool. It's all about consistency, guys. It's all about consistency. That's why you don't want to wreck into everybody. You, that's why you don't want to hit the wall. That's why you just want to run your own race. Every time you're in a race, you want to run your own race. You gotta be patient with the guys in front of you and wait for them to screw up before you make a move on them. It's all about being patient. It's all about consistency. Like I said, I don't give a fuck how fast you are. If you're not consistent, you're not winning. No matter how tight the car is, it pulls right on the straightaway. No matter how tight the car is, well, that's your problem. You need to loosen the car up. You don't want your car tight. Not at all. You don't want any super late mile tight. You, there is not a single it track on this game. It's just weird on the bigger tracks other than Eldora, in there my is not, opinion. There is not a single track on this game where I run my super late model tight.
trying to get a line going on this track. Every time I hit the turn, it feels like I want to spin out. You gotta feather it really fucking good on the turns. Just spun out. Good pass. That was a good one. Good race, Kiwi. Good race. Um, yeah, that track was difficult, man. That track was fun. It was fun and difficult, man. Every time I would hit that turn, I'd just get... I'd pitch it in a little too hard, and I'd spin out. Right after I got done saying I like my cars loose, I want to spin the hell out. Maybe I should have drove a little tighter that race. That infield tire gets me on three and four. Yeah, yeah, man. That's why I was trying to run the high side there for a bit, but every time I would kind of over-rotate the high side and kind of get loose. And that's when you'd really start catching me. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. Really appreciate it. Thank you guys very much for making this week a big success for me. I've been doing YouTube six years. Have not seen any kind of growth like this in my six years on YouTube, so I gotta say huge thank you to everyone that's made this possible for me. Um, we're gonna be making much, 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 much more content on this game. Uh, just like and subscribe for more content, guys. Seriously, I appreciate everything, and uh, yeah, we're gonna keep going. The Big E. Alright. Big E at Eldora. Got a good lap there, 11.242. Yeah, that's cool. One of my thumbnails for uh, my video is uh, the fastest, daily fastest lap category, and I'm fifth on it. It's cool. It's a cool thumbnail. Oh, actually turned on some music. I like Eldora because I feel like I have more space to work with. Yeah. Guys, I'm listening to Juice World.
to know my little fucking name. I can be contained. I'm gonna run the world, it's in my motherfucking name. This is real life, not a motherfucking game. Oh my freak. Did you hit the brakes there, Kiwi? Good race, Kiwi. Good race. Good freaking race, man. No, I... One turn, you... It looked like you slowed down into it. I just fucking ran right in the back here. Yeah. Damn. Now, I think that's my first time winning at Eldora in an elite model. I think I've always came second. So, thank you, Kiwi. Let's go. First win at Eldora in a super late model. Let's go, guys. Man, I might need to get another cup of coffee here soon, man. Damn, look at those lap times. I do got to give a shout out to Dale and Eric Sunny. They are racing phenomenally clean right now. So I got to give them a shout out right now. Eric Sunny B4 and Dale 6667699. You guys have raced phenomenally so far. Thank you guys so much for racing clean and not like uh not driving like you're driving over your head. I we really appreciate that. Uh we are I am live streaming right now, so everything you do do in the race will be captured. Uh so Try not to make yourself look too bad. Um, but thus far, you guys raced phenomenally so far, so I gotta say thank you for that. Shout out to those two men. Everyone knows Kiwi's clean. He's been racing for longer. Everyone knows Kiwi's clean. WHTS, your favorite rail track? Oh man. I'm gonna have to think about that one.
welcome to the stream guys thank you so much for joining make sure you guys like subscribe and some good clean racing here and like super late models Ouch. Oh, shit. Sorry, Kiwi. I didn't mean to come down on you like that. What's my favorite real track? Oh, man. I honestly. I'd say. I, honestly, I think this one is. This one or Charlotte. Las Vegas or Charlotte is my favorite real track so far. I think they're pretty dead even right now for me. Personally. Um, Alright, let me throw on a sweatshirt quick. It's getting kind of chilly in my room here in Pennsylvania. Oh boy, we lost some people. Volusia. See, we can do it. Volusia. So far, so good, though. So far, so good. Kind of curious to see how Volusia is going to treat us. Haven't ran this in a little bit. I know this is kind of an odd shaped track. Don't know how it's going to handle. But we'll give it a shot.
Man, we are running that bottom beautifully. It's a little loose there. Getting a little loose in one tur uh, turns one and two. I felt good. I felt good in that bottom side. I don't I didn't I don't think I got in the Kiwi. Did I get a new Kiwi at all? Woo! I can't compete on the track. No. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, I was nailing that bottom side, man. I I don't even know how I they didn't hit that inside wall, man. I was so close to it. My fender had to have been rubbing up against it. My front fucking fender. It was either, either fucking, like a pencil shaving away from scraping up against that bottom inside wall, or I was on it. But yeah, turns one and two. If I didn't, if I didn't enter, if I didn't hit my marks in one tur turns one and two, I was getting loose. Weed sport, oh god. Close lap times. Beat me by a little bit though. Ugh, weed sport. That's gonna be a wreck fest. Wanna do this track? Um, not really, no. But it's up to you. Yeah, Fairberry's good. Fairberry's good. Weed Sport really isn't a, really isn't one of my favorite tracks. It's odd shaped, and uh, guaranteed there's gonna be a few wrecks in there. Weed Sport turns are so bad. Yeah, yeah. I agree. Weed Sport, Weed Sport. People is, uh... just go flying. Yep. Yep. This is a good track. This is probably in contention to be one of my favorite real tracks in the game, Fairberry. Do it for Dale, baby. Do it for Dale.
No, threw it in a little too hard. Good run, man. Good run. All right. I'm gonna go get another cup of coffee. If I'm not back, Kiwi, by the time we hit the lobby, if you could pause it and wait for me, it shouldn't take longer than two minutes. Thank you. Thank you, Kiwi. I'm back now. Thank you. Um, Kiwi, if you want, we can uh, we can race this and then go on to uh, fictional tracks. We've been racing a lot of real tracks. Some of those fictional ones are pretty damn good, though. Okay. <clears throat> now we're getting a lobby. Look at that. Hopefully these people aren't he crazy. Yeah, hopefully. Um, can you hear me through the game chat, um, Kiwi? Is game chat on? I thought yes. I... Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. So nobody's ha... So n none of these guys have a mic on, I'm guessing. Huh. Yes. Bennett Racing? What's going on, man? How are you? Are you a part of this lobby? Bennett. God damn, I forgot to stir my fucking coffee. It's no good. My controller is dead. Oh, that sucks. Dude, what the fuck, man? Those tires should not do that. They're not a- it's not a fucking wall, it's a tire, man.
Those tires suck. They're it's exactly right. They're tires, not walls. I'm not exactly fucking sure why they fucking made them like that. Um, they did everything right in other tracks with the tire physics making a move, but these tires are served as walls, I guess? Why don't you just put a fucking wall there? I mean, <laughs> I mean, you might as well, right? I mean, if, if we're gonna be realistic, if we're gonna pretend like those tires are walls, you might as well just put a wall there. EY, I watch Cedar Lake all the time. I watch people run over those tires without fucking issue. But not in this game, no. It would definitely make less chaotic. Yes, yes it would. Fit fast, damn. Canyon County, oh boy. I'm still trying to figure out why these none of these guys have mics. It's either in a lobby talking to each other or something. I have no idea. Make sure you guys like and subscribe, I'd really appreciate it. Thank you. Come on now, seriously? Who is that? I just got spun out, dude, by some fucking dickhead. Kiwi, you're gonna have to boot some people after this fucking race, man. I'm they're not gonna they're not gonna spin someone out in the first lap and then continue the race. that guy. That's who it was. Just fucking ruined my race in the first turn, dude. Go ahead. Dude, you're a terrible driver. Fucking terrible driver. That's what she deserved, guys. That's what she deserved, whoever the fuck that was. They had it coming. I can't believe I'm driving these guys down. 
after that fucking chaotic start. Alright. Uh, the guy who left needs to be booted. Trace Ashby. I, I love, I love how she just ruins my race and then leaves after I give her a fucking receipt back. I just fucking love those kind of people. You know, you ruin somebody's race, you don't fucking win, you spin them out in the first fucking turn of the race. It's just fucking pathetic, dude. You don't know how to fucking drive. Keep the fuck out of this game. Go back to playing Fortnite or Minecraft or whatever the fuck hellhole you came from. And just stay how off the fucking like game. How should I kick? I, I don't think you need to kick him anymore. You left. Seven laps down. <clears throat> who? The guy who went seven laps down. He's down. He's out. Oh, okay. If chaotic there at the front, we were four wide. Yeah, I wish I could have been up there. God knows I had the speed. Look at that fucking time. Unfucking believable, dude. Alright, let's take a sip of this coffee. Hopefully it's not too hot. Mmm. Just right, guys. Just right. My coffee's just right. Just warm enough to make me want to shit. <laughs> oh, God. I'm kidding. Come on. Ugh. That bottom is rough. Gaining a pretty good lead right now. Putting almost half a straightaway on him.
What a rate. Oh my god, are you kidding me, dude? Well, I'm fucked. Hopefully not, but come on. <sighs> Don't put a cowboy move on me. Don't put a cowboy move on me. Are you fucking for real, dude? Are you fucking for real? I'm not losing this race. Sorry, Kiwi. I'm not losing that race. Fuck that, dude. I'm not losing that fucking race. I don't... I'm sorry, Kiwi. I'm sorry, but I'm not losing that race. I wasn't losing that race. Kiwi I was just wrecked. That's fucking bullshit, dude. I ain't losing that race. <sighs> All that fucking work. Gecko and some other Idwa wrecked and drew the caution. Yeah. It's whatever. Sorry, sorry I had to fucking push you out of the way to get that win, but I ain't fucking losing. I, I put half a straight away on those guys until fucking last lap. It, 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 they're, they're, it's like they're working together. They're not talking in the game chat. They're probably in fucking voice chat. Alright, draw the caution so I can try to win this. Scoot, scooter. Not much. <sighs> Straight river. Broken Wheel did good that race. Just fucking, I don't, I don't understand the fact why he couldn't let off. I put a slide job on him. What the, what the fuck does he do? He's good. He runs straight into the my ass end of me. But yeah, I, I wasn't gonna lose that race. I put half a fucking straightaway on him. Put half a fucking straightaway on him. I'm not losing that race. Fastest car on the track. No, I didn't have the fastest lap, but I was the most consistent. What? Does it sound like I'm whining? Does it? Does it sound like I'm whining, retard? Oh, okay. want to call names you're gonna eat the wall I wasn't whining I won the race how is that whining I didn't say why did that jackass hit me I said okay well then I apologize dude that's all you got to say Yep, yep, and I'm not calling you names, dude. That's all I needed to hear. I didn't hear any. I didn't hear. Didn't hear anything from you until now. So we're good. We're 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 good. We're good. We're good. My apologies. It's like a hole in one and two. Almost.
Man, that bot. Like, subscribe, and share. Thank you, Mod. Thank you, Mod. Welcome back to the stream, Mod. It's been a couple days. I see you coming, Broken Wheel. If you get under me, I'll let you go. Yeah, I know, but now I kind of feel bad. I don't want to... I didn't... I didn't... Ah, I'm, I'm sorry, dude. I, I didn't want to piss you off, man. No, you're good, man. You're good. I'm, I'm, I apologize for jumping the gun, jumping to conclusions. Shouldn't have done you like that. Shouldn't have done you like that. So my apologies, man. Stick around. We'll we'll have a good clean one. How do you feel, Speedy Trucker? Nah, this is Speedy Truck. <laughs> scootin' Scooter. I can't. I, like I'm gonna call you Scootin'. Scooter, all right, all right. It's you know I've known you for four years now for a speedy trucker, so it's gonna be hard. Yes, speedy trucker is in my lobby, guys. Yes, he is. <laughs> Bones! 007's in here! I haven't had- I haven't seen that guy in fucking ages. Good lap, Broken. Good lap. Uh, I'm on a controller. I wish I was on a wheel. My wheel broke two weeks before this game was released. Oh, I just got the cheap Walmart kind of. It's the Thrustmaster T80 something. Yeah, cheapo. I was playing NASCAR Heat 5 for a bit, and people were bitching at anyone who used a controller because you couldn't hold a line, especially when you were racing, like, NASCAR asphalt. So you're bouncing all over the place, so you kind of needed a wheel, or else you're going to get kicked off online lobbies. Yep, Thrustmaster T80 junked. Yeah, I paid $110 for that fucking wheel and it only lasted me three months. Sounds good. Best advice I can give you is let off and roll into the turns. This is a difficult track. I don't think I've ever ran these for super late models before. You should you you should fucking rename your gamer tag. Scooter, the speedy scooter. Speedy clicker, eh? Right? There you go. Mine popped into neutral. Your car popped into neutral? You have a manual on? Bennett, you're a fucking savage. 
Yeah, he, he has a manual set up. He's, he's shifting all by himself. He said he popped it into neutral. I don't think you need a manual for a one gear super late model, but hell, that's what the guy's racing. Okay, now it's getting a little chaotic. <laughs> Through the gun. Damn, that was difficult. Good run, wheel. That was a little chaotic there after that caution. Yes, sir, this is an expert lobby. Yes. I know plenty of people who use assist, but you're not going to get the full game experience using assist. I have not, no. I, I'm, I'm running stock controller settings. Bennett Racing's a fucking savage. I run better with no aids. Me too, Bennett, me too. Yes.
it takes more than one person to wreck for a free of caution. Cautions are on. Good run broken. Good run. Good run. Yeah, you didn't get lapped either. Good run. Want to do real tracks again? Or keep doing fantasy tracks? Um, Kiwi, just, just, uh, just run it down the list for right now. Just skip the tracks that I say to skip. Uh, but we'll run it down the list. I know which tracks to run and which not. Yeah, we can run this one. We can run this one. If you can pause it quick, Kiwi. Alright. Alright guys, we're going to pause it for a minute or two. I need to take a bathroom break. So if you guys want to play for controller settings, we'll have a pause. All right, I'm back. I'm guessing Scooter went to go play with his controller settings. All right, cool. We'll wait. We'll give him a minute or two. Um, you can go ahead and kick out that last guy. Beast. Make some room for Scooter. I think I'm gonna run 75% loose here at port. Yeah, I, I usually run my uh, my crap loose, especially in super late models. All right, you can uh, here in a minute, Kiwi. Yeah, you can unpause it. He's just going to have to join back after the race, or hopefully he gets in before. Yeah, good time, Kiwi. Very good. Yeah, it was. Look at those times, man. Yeah, Kiwi, we, we can do real tracks again. Just uh, just run it down the list. So it really doesn't matter. I actually live in PA. I think the last 410 track I went to was port for the Tusk Roar R50.
Okay, I think loose was not the way to go. Oh shit, was that me? Loose is fast. Yeah, I think so. I think I thought loose was fast, but I am from Delaware, Big Blocks Country. Delaware. I might sound like white trash here, but I go on vacation to Delaware. <laughs> I'm coming around the inside. Oh, caution. Oh, and you still go a lap down. That's not fair. Well, this, that caution is beneficial to broken wheel. I know he screwed, or we screwed up there beginning. They are October and modified and no big rocks. Oh, we're getting loose. I'll let you have the inside. Yes, sir, this is the World of Outlaw game. Let's go, hometown win. Hometown win. Let's go, baby. Good race, guys. Yeah, that was a good one. We did our best there for Port Royal. Woo! It always feels good to win in your hometown, guys. Come on. Yep, in October they are adding uh, UMP modifieds and big blocks with other drivers. Uh, if you're a PA fan and you're a Danny Dietrich, uh, Anthony Macri, uh, Lance DeWeese kind of guy, I guarantee they're going to be added in either the DLC in late December, mid-October, along with other drivers. I heard there's going to be a total of 144 real-life drivers to choose from in this game after it's all said and done, along with 140 plus tracks to go along with it. Uh, so there's a lot of DLCs to come for this game. Sorry, did I say 150 real tracks? I meant uh, 60. There's going to be 140 plus real life drivers in the game uh, spread across all the classes and then there's going to be 60 plus Wash tracks hands.
Broken wheel, nice time, dude. Holy hell. Ready for that. I am ready for that, man. I am ready. There's a whole bunch of updates coming to this game, man. They took they really took their time making this game. And uh I'm just excited for the future of it. Especially when you're in clean lobbies like this, man. Everything feels right in the world. Everything feels right in the world when you're racing clean with your friends, man. Everything feels right. But when you when you get in that one lobby where everyone just doesn't care and wrecks each other, kind of makes you lose interest quick. But when you're in clean lobbies like this, it really makes you love the game. <clears throat> Prairie Creek. Waiting for the game to come in. Yeah, guys, if you haven't picked up this game already, go ahead and pick it up. It is well worth the money. Yes, I do have a little piece of involvement in the next update. Uh, so what iRacing and Monster Games does is they take content creators and ask for their input. So I do have a little bit of input to say in the next update in October where the UMP modifies. I'm getting early access to that, the tracks, and all the other things. Just to give them my input. Uh, Jeff Favingo, I believe his name is, along with uh, many other content creators are getting early releases. And uh, what Monster Games and iRacing does is ask those content creators uh, about their input, what they feel about them. So we're all we're all working pretty hard. Uh, we were in a two-hour Skype call yesterday with the physics designers yesterday, talking about the new update. So I, I can guarantee you the UMP modified update and big block update is going to be well worth your time. Oh, great job, dude! <laughs> I almost got taken out there. Good run, man. What happened to you, Broken? We want to just get a little too up high? <clears throat> gotcha. Yeah, that was a good one. You're you're right on my ass. I want to see a game where there is forward class. Like, subscribe, and share. How's it going, man? A f <laughs> you want to see a game where there's a four-wheel drive class? Wow. You might want to play a uh, Wreckfest or, or some kind of rally racing game. Um, like, subscribe, share. Thank you. Uh, it's going pretty good. How are you, Josh? Good times, good times. Look at that. Front wheel. Oh, front wheel drive. Sorry, Bennett. Uh, honestly, I think they're... Is the Street Sox front wheel drive in this game? Does anyone know? The rear wheel. Um, does anyone know any front wheel, front wheel drive classes that run on dirt? Besides, like, the rally racing games? I 
I really don't. Not I bad. Tried four one zero s last Nini died and go well. Yeah, I, I don't I don't think there's any oval dirt track games or oval dirt racing games that have front wheel drive classes. Maybe besides like the beaters. Most four bangers mini stocks. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, yeah. There's that. But really, I mean, if they added that in the game, how many people are gonna play it? You know what I mean? <laughs> no disrespect to you, Bennett, but. But I didn't see one. But if they added four banger mini stocks in the game, I wonder how many people are gonna be playing that. Maybe back on the factor days. Oh no, getting a little loose. Maybe back in our factor days. Yeah. <laughs> Broken wheel. What the hell happened to him? Sad to see him go, man. Damn talk about close there. Yeah, that guy was on me, huh? Kiwi, don't do this track, please. Thank you. Yeah, I'm gonna run it like... Who, me? Yeah, I'm on PlayStation. Uh-oh, guys, my coffee's getting low. 
Should this be my last cup or something? Shit, sorry. Or no, that was Kiwi, I think. Holy hell. This game's so high banking. Good run, Corey. See you, man. Cheap Mountain. Oh boy. This ought to be a good one. Ugh.
Dude, why is everyone wrecking, man? Just come on. U.S. Marine, what the fuck are you doing, man? I just watched you body like three people. Smack and back. Sorry, my car was so loose and I was on the phone with my mom. Run it up.
Oh, run it up. Sorry, my car was loose and I was on the phone with my mom. Redneck Alex. You must be in the race then. Damn, talk about close there. Smack him back. Caution. Oh boy. Man, you must have had to try to cause a caution on this track. These last two guys are getting kicked out. Whoever's in last, the last two positions need to be booted. Because they're obviously the ones causing it. Maybe U.S. Marine too. Because he was pumping and grinding last night. Or last race. Well, I think he's Redneck Alex. So I don't, I don't think he's potentially trying. I think he's in my live chat. So I think just the last two guys... Good line down there in the bottom. Good run. Yeah, whoever that mama zombie is, I can tell he's dirty just by his fucking name. <laughs> it was the one car causing them. It was the one car? Dale? Dale. Dale's been in this lobby for a while. I don't think he was trying. Someone in my live chat's in the lobby, and he's saying uh, it was Dale causing all our accidents. But he's been in the lobby for a while, so I'll give him one more chance. So let's the not kick anybody. The first one might have been me. He was trying to dump me. 
Oh, man. I got a whole bunch of people in my... So drop your guys' gamer tag so I know who who's who. Sorry, Wanty, trying to. Don't kick anybody, Kiwi. Don't kick anybody. Drop your guys' gamer tag so I know who's who. I'm guessing U.S. Marines, redneck. Car was losses. I'm on YouTube. Us Marine. Okay, that's why I thought redneck. Dale six six seven six nine nine. Okay. So we got it figured out. Dale, Dale's good. Kiwi zero one four five seven. Yeah. <laughs> Kiwi, I fucking know. <laughs> oh shit. Laughing. Already? There's a tire on the track already, dude? Alright, maybe this guy... Maybe this truest guy needs to be gone. This guy in the last place. TX, USA, TX. Texas, USA, Texas. I don't... I, I, I think that's what he's going for. U.S. Marine, calm down, man. Redneck Alex, come on. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, U.S. Marine, chill out, dude. Chill out, Redneck Alex. I'm to bet there's going to be another caution before this is all said and done. Yeah, host, uh, Kiwi, you can go ahead and kick the guy who's, uh, getting lapped right now, after this lobby. He has somehow found himself backwards and on the wall just about every other lap. Up, oh, he left. He got the, he got the memo. <clears throat> We can make more. Yeah, he's he's done. He's gone. 
Sorry, LaCroix. Sorry, man. I know you had a fast line up top. That tire was in the way, huh? Yeah, I'm, I'm thankful I'm a bottom feeder. I, I didn't make contact of it once. Yeah. There's there's a certain select few I can run the top and get away with it. Yeah. Actually, uh, Kiwi, if you want to go to Eldora, we can. I wouldn't mind running Eldora again. It's up top. See how this lobby does. Yeah, let's run Volusia. We'll run Volusia and then go to uh, Eldora. What's going on, Austin? <laughs> yeah, another damn paradise. We support our troops. Well, you know what? I'm still young. I'm still young. I'm still young and I just found out this guy is in the army. I'm just gonna ask him a classic question. How many people have you killed? You've killed no people? I can tell you how many people. Oh shit. Dude, my my old uh, my fit my fifth grade teacher was in the army, right? And we were sitting in class one day, and he told us, "Yeah, I used to be in the army." And the whole class stood up and was like, "So you've killed people?" And he said, "Yeah, I've killed uh, about a half dozen people <laughs> right in front of all the fifth grade students." And we were all fucking like, "Uh, our teacher killed the people before?" But he was like the nicest dude. I forget his name, Irwin or something, Mr. Irwin. Sorry for coming down on you, LaCroix. Oh, shit. Oh, sorry, fuck Kiwi. Car is a little too loose, uh, tight.
could freaking race, man. Yeah, that was a good one. Look at our times, man. Look at those times. Oh! Gotcha. So, you're working on, like, Humvees and all that. Ah, okay. Cool, cool, cool. Now, are you at your base at, like for like months at a time before you go home, or? Oh, oh, he has military housing. Okay. So what, you, you have like military housing, you're just based up there? Okay, okay, gotcha. Damn. Williams Grove, oh no, I didn't even set up my fuck car. Oh man. Oh man. I didn't even set up my car for Williams Grove. Do you know if they are adding Cherokee Speedway? I do not know for sure, but I'm willing to bet they are adding gonna add Cherokee Speedway. I think they're going to pretty much add every track that's on iRacing to this game. Yeah, mine too. I can't go, I'm on the wall. Nah, you're good, you're good.
Good run, man. Good run, weird. Savage. Weird savage. What? <laughs> I can't. I don't know how to pronounce your gamer tag. Yeah, man, I, 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 I didn't even set my car up. I was at 50 and it was way too tight. No, no. <laughs> my brakes are fucking melded. The slowest lap. God damn. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to go with 62% loose. Make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe. We really appreciate it. Thank you very much.
Good run. Yeah, yeah, every time I moved up the track, somebody was doing a side job at me, so I had to move down eventually. All right, Let's see what we got here. The bottom's really fucking good.
Oh, all right, guys. I think I got a couple more runs in me. Big E. Yeah, the, the bottom was fast. I was feathering it down the very bottom, but this stuck like a champ. God help them. Bad move, bad move.
Oh, party foul. Come on. You need to look out for those sliders a little bit better. Ugh. Yeah, you too, man. All right, guys, I'm getting off. I'm I'm tired. I got shit to do. Ah, good running.